Hey, it's Chris from Funtech Guys, and this is just an app review for a Google Chrome extension that I've installed, and it's absolutely brilliant. I find myself reading articles more often than not on a daily basis, and I just want to share it with you, and um, because a couple of you have asked what it is when I when I load it up, so this is the screen. But let's just get to get there first. So I've got Chrome apps. Click on the top link. And in the search bar, just search Panda and just search for extensions. Once it's caught up, it's this one here, News and Inspiration. So I'm not sure what the difference is between those. I think they're the exact same, to be honest. I can use Drupal for designing this. Anyhow, I've got this one installed. Um, I just click Free and then Install and then Restart the Browser. Once you restart the browser, you're prompted with this window. It actually looks like this the first time you when you first load it so you get designing news and dribble dribble is absolutely brilliant I love just you know seeing what what people are designing you click on it you take you straight off to this guy's um, site that he's making and yeah you can spend some time you can you can seriously kill some time on this anyhow um, you click on the little menu up here and you can change the layouts and I like having news, inspiration and news. I like a bit of front-end uh, design, inspiration, but I also like just you know keeping up to date with what's going on in the, in the coding world. But at the same time, sometimes I just mix it up and just see what's going on in the news and, and whatnot. I've not actually had a chance to sign up and register it yet, but uh, I'm sure one of you guys will sign up and tell me what functionality you get from signing up, if any at all. But it does everything that, that I need it to do when I'm not signed up, so I've, I've not been, had any desire just yet. So, close it down. It's also got a nice little feature here, which is display job listings. Which, once you guys obviously get a little bit you know, higher up and you, you, you've developed a little bit more, or you've designed quite a bit and you're, you're looking at getting out there, then this is quite a, uh, a nice little feature. Plenty of jobs. Anyhow, close it off. That's not, not of interest at the moment. So, and on the top of each bar, it tells us where where it's pulling the the latest stories from, or the latest information, or whatnot. And you can sort it by popular, or latest. Oh, that one's not working for some reason. Yeah, latest or popular. I'll just let that catch up. And if you click on the name of each one of them, you can actually change it around. So if I wanted to just show Hacker News, let that catch up. It's pulled all the stories. And it's just giving me the top, what is it, top 29, that's a weird number, 30, I'm guessing with this wanted link, uh, top 30 uh, uh, entries, same with Dribble and over here as well, if I just change that to design and use, and it's absolutely brilliant, I I, I use it so much, I, I find so many useful articles and, and sometimes I just can kill hours just flicking through and let's just see if I can find something quickly. Do you, do you charge your clients hourly? Is that how is it that possible? There you go. That seems like it. I'd give it. It'd be an interesting read. And apparently, I can't read at the moment. Uh, yeah, but there's, there's always something. So yeah, Panda, Chrome extension. Give it a go. It's uh, it's seriously worth having installed. Cheers. Thanks for watching.